you have to be mindful that we have perfect squares and we're talking about a binomial. So there's a high chance that we're dealing with the difference of squares. But what we need to do first is take out a greatest common factor. And our GCF would be 9y. Once we divide the expressions by 9y, we're going to have 4 minus 9x squared. And if you look at what's inside the parentheses, we're still dealing with perfect squares and we have a binomial. So 9y stays the same. The square root of 4 is 2. Square root of 9x squared is 3x. So we're going to write this expression twice. And then we're going to alternate the signs. So the correct answer would be answer choice B. And just remember, when you're missing that middle term and you have a binomial expression, there's a high chance that we're dealing with the difference of squares.